Now, Action 10 Sonia Hill with your Doppler 10 weather forecast. Hey there, South Texas. Happy Thursday to you all. Hope you're having a fantastic Thursday afternoon. So if you've been outside today, you probably noticed we are enjoying wonderfully beautiful weather conditions here in South Texas. And here's the proof right now in Corpus Christi. We are seeing mostly clear skies. We're sitting at a very comfortable 64 degrees and we are seeing light winds out of the east blowing at 14 miles per hour. Now we take you to Beeville up there in Beeville. They are seeing clear skies a bit warmer than it is here in Corpus Christi. They're sitting at 69 degrees here in Corpus we're sitting at 64. The winds are out of the east southeast at 13 miles per hour, but check out that humidity in Beeville very low in the 30th percentile. But checking out what we can expect tonight across the coastal bend. Unfortunately, we're going to begin to see some changes. We're going to see increasing cloudiness lows again tonight. Most of us will be seeing lows in the 50s here in Corpus Christi dropping to 56 degrees. Expect light winds out of the east southeast only up to about 10 miles per hour. Now checking out the visible satellite earlier today, we saw Plenty of cloud coverage to our west, but as the day unfolded, most of that cloud coverage has dissipated, leaving us with mostly clear skies across our region. Now checking out the state satellite, kind of a similar story to our north. Lots of cloud coverage, especially in the Dallas area up through San Antonio as well. But um, up there as well, the cloud coverage has dissipated. Most of the state right now is seeing rather stable conditions. But earlier today, that was not the case. There was some light rain observed north of Dallas and also in central parts of the state. And now focus your attention to our west, West Texas right now. They are beginning to see increasing cloudiness from, e from west to east and also some showers and storms behind that increasing cloudiness probably going to be moving into deep west Texas here in the next couple of hours. Now checking out the future tracker tomorrow, Friday, 7 o'clock in the morning, seeing plenty of cloudiness here in our area, especially to our north. But to our northwest, we're going to begin to see some showers and storms firing up all ahead of the arrival of our next front, which should be arriving Friday night into Saturday morning. Now moving that future tracker along. Here we are Saturday, 6 o'clock in the morning. There is that front drift over the coastal bend. Rain will be possible early Saturday ahead of the arrival of this front. And then as Saturday continues, expect mostly sunny skies. Beautiful conditions for our Saturday as that front moves through and takes all that nasty cloudiness and light rain with it. But unfortunately, as we get into Sunday, things are going to begin changing once again. We will see clouds increasing on Sunday and temperatures dropping as well. Now, breaking down the weekend forecast, Saturday definitely the nicer day, low humidity, a Abundant sunshine, warm temperatures, but Sunday just like that. Cloudy skies, highs in the 50s. Expect a high of 59 degrees for Saturday, uh, for Sunday. So Saturday definitely the nicer day this upcoming weekend. Now breaking down tomorrow's forecast, hard to believe, but tomorrow is already Friday. Taking a longer look at Friday, 7 a.m. 56 degrees, mostly cloudy skies. Noon mostly cloudy, even warmer near 70 degrees. By 3 p.m. overcast skies in the low 70s. Now by 6 p.m. ahead of the arrival of that front, rain chances will begin to increase. Expect overcast skies. 67 degrees now breaking down the future tracker. Here we are Friday 7 o'clock in the morning. Cloudy skies ahead of that front. But as the day goes on, rain chances to our west will begin to migrate to our area by Friday evening. Rain chances will be highest in our northern and western counties ahead of that front. Still seeing cloudy skies tomorrow. And then as we get into Saturday morning, uh, we're going to see, you know, still cloudy skies as that front moves through. And then, of course, Later on Saturday, the uh, cloud coverage will begin to dissipate. Now, taking a look at your extended forecast brought to you by AutoNation. They will purchase your car even if you don't purchase a car from them. Shop now at AutoNation.com. Now, breaking down the seven day forecast tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies still in the 70s, but Friday night, Saturday morning, that's when our next front is arriving. Isolated showers will be possible with its arrival Saturday. Very nice in the 70s, dry and warm, but Sunday just like that in the upper 50s, plenty of cloud coverage. Now, Monday will still be rather cool in the 50s. Tuesday, low chance of rain starting to slowly warm back up. Expect to see highs in the 60s and varying amounts of cloudiness for Wednesday and Thursday of next week. That's all the time for me in the forecast. Andy, back to you.